Hey guys, today I'm gonna to be talking about my dice collection. A lot of you have asked about it. Um, the reason I have so much dice, and this is just the dice I haven't put in storage. I, every so often when I have a box of dice, so like the box of dice, um, I will put the dice back in storage. Uh, so this is mostly the recent stuff I've opened. Uh, I've opened 20 pre-release kits and they're mostly Ojate because the Ojate Dragon Leader is the most valuable of them. And the foil one runs $40, so if you open one of them in your pre-release kit, which is extremely common in my opinion, I believe it's in one every four kits you can get a foil mythic dragon. I definitely do so, especially if the mythic dragon is 40 bucks at the time of the recording. So you can see how I've opened a ton of that, those, and the dice is also the, in my opinion, the one of the best looking dice. Uh, the purple dice is better, but this dice is not bad. Uh, I opened eight, yes, eight of these, and the other dice I opened, a ton of, was purple dice. So the, in my opinion, I've only open one pre-release kit, I believe, for the, what's it called? Jomoka. So the green, red, the green, white one is not as good uh, value-wise as the other ones. And the other one I didn't really want to open was Slim Mugar, or don't know how to say his name, but uh, the blue-black one isn't as good in my opinion as the other ones. Colagon is very interesting because so many people played Colagon at pre-release because that was definitely the best colors. And that's, in my opinion, the deck that can win the best, the most, at pre-release. So there's actually that, not that many pre-release kits for Colagon. But the other one, which name escapes me at this time, Ataka, I believe, would be the one. And she has a beautiful dice, and obviously Ataka is my favorite dragon because I feel like seven, and you get a huge dragon that deals five damage. I've seen that dragon before. It was called. It was played in a deck that dominated standard at the time, the Dragon Storm deck, and that was like the beginning of Storm. Was Dragon Storm? Uh, that, that was such a fun deck. Um, essentially, you stormed it and then you brought out like what was the dragon's name bolegan dragon or something and he would just deal five damage or something and you storm up to four and then you copy it four times and you put out five those guys and then you just kill your opponent but ataka is one of my favorite now these are just dice that i've opened from recent fat packs uh this one is the from the vault legends uh they have very good dice the commander dice is very good the commander dice is actually really weird i kind of want one but i don't own one i opened a lot of cons of tarkir i feel like fate reforged and cons of tarkir have the same purple dice weird right very strange like cons of tarkir fate reforged fate reforged i think fate reforged only had a purple dice but Contra Tarkir, if I remember correctly, have different color. Yeah, they have brown dice too. Yeah, the Contra Tarkir dice, in my opinion, were not very good. Oh, Born of the Gods. Yeah, got some Born of Gods, some more Contra Tarkir. Uh, what's this one? This one looks pretty good. Oh, Born of the Gods too. So I guess I've opened a lot of Born Contra Tarkir, but my RTR dice are somewhere else. I think I've only opened a few. RTR fat packs because they're getting pretty expensive nowadays. And this one is Dragon Maze. I know this one. No, not Dragon Maze. I know I have Dragon Maze here somewhere. Uh, Dragon Maze, yes. Again, I open a lot of Dragon Maze and I like Dragon Maze. So solid colors seem to be Cons of Tarkir or Born of the Gods. Is this Born of the Gods? Journey into Nyx? It might be Journey into Nyx because I remember like putting a lot of stuff in storage around that time. Yeah, so this is something else. Um, Contra Tarkir, Contra Tarkir. Oh, this is uh, RT, no, Dragon Maze again. Wow, cool. What are these? Uh, whatever this set is again. <laughs> so I opened a ton of this set. What is this set? I want to say it's Born of the Gods, but that doesn't sound right. Journey into Nyx? But as you, oh, Avacyn, yeah, I opened a fat pack of Avacyn recently, which is pretty cool. 
Uh, I do like Avacyn dice a lot. Um, the nice little platinum type of dice. Yeah, I would say the worst dice would be Khan to Tarkir. Their dice was like very soft. Oh man, look at this dice. It's like misprinted. I wonder. Oh no, it's just stained. It just has a stain on it. <laughs> it's late. I'm going back to Anime Missouri. I'm sorry if this video is like kind of lame, but a lot of you wanted to see a dice collection. Um, I promised to bring back all my other dice. I think I gotta make like a mox video and then like a token video and then I'm done. For the week. Bye guys. Oh, and a deck video.